I was born in Barcelona um, and I first came here into, into St. George during my high school years. I was a student at Snow Canyon um, and I immediately fell in love with the Red Sands so I decided to pursue my higher education uh, at the time at Dixie State. I graduated in December uh, 2021 and I was the last graduating class of uh, Dixie State. And funny enough, my wife was the first graduating class of Utah Tech. Yeah, so very early on I learned uh, what it meant to get what you're going to put in. And it's something that, that Dixie State at the time in Utah Tech lives by. Uh, whatever you put in, you're going to get out of. I was very involved with student government and, and the Institute of Politics. I was fortunate enough to serve as a member of the Student Executive Council. After my years in school, I immediately wanted to keep being involved with the university. And so I applied for the alumni board and fortunately got accepted to it. It's been a great opportunity to see the university from the other side and to, to still be involved um, in, for, in, in pushing the mission of the institution as an alumni. I try to embody the trailblazer spirit by looking within and trying to find which paths I should blaze forward. I think that once again, we owe it to ourselves to do that. And I love that this institution, the very lifeblood of it, uh, is surrounded by this motto of being a trailblazer. You gotta find your way and stay true to it. And that hopefully leads you to live the life you wanna live and be involved in the way that you want to and, and help people in the way that you see fit. I would encourage everybody to, to stay in touch with the institution, to keep giving, not monetarily necessarily, but with time and, and with involvement. And I truly believe that it will pay dividends. I've seen it in my life and I am excited to keep seeing where it goes. And again, I would just encourage anybody to take a leap of faith and do the same thing.